Each year, we welcome thousands of nonprofits to the Nonprofit Technology Conference. This year, the 12 NPC will be held in San Francisco on April 3rd through the 5th. Learn more at n10.org forward slash NTC. Or if you can't join us in person, find out how you can still connect, learn, and change the world at the NTC online. Learn more at n10.org forward slash NTC forward slash online. We've put together a series of video podcasts featuring just a few of the more than 100 sessions of the event. Today, we're talking to Namho Park from Forum One Communications, who will be leading the session, Four Strategies for Going Mobile. Tell us about yourself. Hi, uh, my name is Namho Park. Uh, I work for Forum One Communications. I am the Director of Mobile Services at Forum One, and I'm located in Seattle, but our main Forum One office is, is in Washington, D.C. Why is mobile important? It's not just about talking to people, but in you know inter interfacing with uh, uh, with other people through social media, um, through games, and through uh, interacting with information through through smartphones. And I think it's it's really important that um, that since it's you know growing in importance in in the way that people engage, especially nonprofit organizations engage their uh, stakeholders and audiences. I think that's the reason why I wanted to put something together. Is it really important? From the stats that I've seen from Pew, for example, I think it's like 90 minutes. Uh, an average person, you know, looks at their smartphone for 90 minutes, if not more, a day. Is there a downside to mobile? A lot of people are kind of have, have this kind of posture all the time, right? Walking, looking at their phones, you know, on buses, looking at their phones, you know. Half the bus that I use to commute on were looking at their phones. You see people sitting in cafes looking at their phones and not talking to each other. What's different about designing for the mobile web? On mobile, you're actually limited to a small screen. So for nonprofit organizations, that means two things, I think. It means the fact that whoever's engaging with you is limited to a certain number of tasks, and you can really focus on those tasks. For example, if they want to engage in a conversation with you, if they want to download information from you, if they want to engage with other people in the community, those things are so more readily available uh, and deeply, you know, far more deeply engaging. Uh, and, it, and it's always on and it's always with you. So in terms of the way that nonprofits can engage their stakeholders and their audiences is, is, is I mean, there's a huge opportunity. What does mobile make possible for nonprofits? Three things are transformed by uh, mobility, a mobile strategy. The first thing is to work space. The second thing is the workplace, and the third thing is the workforce. I thought I thought that was that was a very kind of astute observation in that the workspace, the way that we work with computers, the way that we you know you know work on the go with our with our cell phones uh, and our smartphones, that workspace is transformed. We have you know um, we use uh, Dropbox, we use you know. Uh, Skype, we use all these kind of technologies to interface with people and the workspace has come. The workplace is also transformed as well. You don't need to stay at your desk anymore. You can go almost anywhere in the world. So the workspace and the way that people interact with each other in the workspace has changed. But also the skills that you need in the workforce is also changing. You know, people who, who you know, the, the skill sets and the way that they work and, and the mind frame also needs to change. So I thought those three you know, key words in terms of the way that we're, we're transforming the way that we work, the way that we work, was, was a, was a you know, great observation. Can small nonprofits get in on the mobile action? The good news is that a lot of people are thinking about this and a lot of open source software already have mobile themes and mobile technologies baked into you know, their, their technology. So if you're a small nonprofit uh, using WordPress for your website, there's a plugin out there. There is a theme out there. All you need to do in, in a couple of minutes is enable those things, and you're already mobile. You're already optimized for that little screen. So that's the good news. Right, right. I mean, you hear that. I mean, you hear that little chime, and you just have to pull out your cell phone. Yeah. yeah. Whether you're driving, I think. I think I'm all for disabling those things when you're moving at a certain velocity, because it's really distracting.